To import a 3D model into an assembly design, simply click on the Import File tool directly from the main toolbar and the Import File dialog appears. Next you need to specify which type of format you'd like to bring in. A Libre Design supports STEP, SAT, and IGES data for 3D models. You can also import a native Alibre Design file by selecting the Alibre file type. Next you select the file and click the Open button to import it. The Import Options dialog may appear, in which case you can specify the applicable import options and then click OK to import it into the workspace. In this case I've inserted a standard fastener for my assembly. Now I can actually use this as needed in my assembly design and I can apply constraints to it. I'm going to apply a make constraint and an align constraint using the auto constrain mode tool. So I selected the applicable cylindrical faces and an align constraint was automatically applied. Next I'll select two planar faces on the design and a make constraint is automatically applied as well. On a final note for this segment, I want to point out that you can calculate the physical properties of the entire assembly design. To do so, I'll turn the inspection toolbar on and then I need to select the physical properties tool and the physical properties dialog appears. First, you need to specify the accuracy level that you're looking for. I'm going to choose the high accuracy level and then click OK. The physical properties for the entire assembly design are displayed. So I can calculate the total volume and the total mass of my assembly. It's very important to note that the mass value in this case is based on the individual density values that you applied in each respective part workspace. So be sure to always set the correct density values for each part individually to get the correct property values for your assembly if you're interested in finding out physical properties of your design. This concludes this segment of the video.